tell me nobody robbed a liquor store on the lower part of town black lives matter didn't kill anyone or burn the business down nobody fired a shot in anger nobody had to die in vain we sure could use a little good news today Elwood. Tell me, nobody robbed a liquor store on the lower part of town. Nobody, Black Lives Matter didn't kill anyone or burn their business down. Nobody fired a shot in anger, nobody had to die in vain. Sure could use a little good news today. Rip on! No, don't sing that one. What? Well, looks like it's just us, Raymond. Just me and you, all by our lonesome. I thought Alvin was here, but when I spoke to him, he didn't speak back. So I'm guessing he commented and left. And why not sing that one? That's a damn good song. Boy, don't make me come after you. Hey, welcome back, Albert. And we're up to a threesome. But Raymond, you didn't answer my question. What's wrong with that song? Aside from the fact that I changed the lyrics. <laughs> Got a good singer. Hmm. Not sure if I should be insulted about that or not. I'm here paying for the postage for your goodies to be mailed tomorrow. Yours! Can sing. Are you saying I'm not a good singer? Rolled out this morning. The kids had a morning new show on.
Would I say that? I don't know. How close to my mom are you? Costs less to mail it to Michigan. Don't pay any attention to him, Richard. It does not. It costs double. <laughs> Some reporter talking about a war that can't be won. Some senator squawking about a bad economy. It's going to get worse, you see. Need a change in policy. <laughs> Giggity. Oh, shit. <laughs> There's a local paper rolled up in a rubber band. One more sad story is one more than I can stand. <clears throat> Justin, Officer Justin in the house. <coughs> you want my earthquake? I will send you that. Oh, God. Happy about it? Absolutely. Just once, how I'd like to see the headlines say, not much to print today. Can't find nothing bad to say Oh, tell me Nobody robbed a liquor store On the lower part of town Black Lives Matter didn't kill anyone Or burn their business down Okay, and I will never sing again, thanks Paper now for it. Huh. Yep, Raymond, congrats to Trump. No clue what that means. Uh, because that comment came, well, it hits a little too close to home. Post congrats to Trump, and I decided to congratulate him too, even though I don't know what for. Oh, okay, <laughs> I have no idea. Um, just to keep this short and sweet, guys, uh, I put up a bonus episode of the podcast, the audiobooks podcast. How are you doing tonight, Trish? Doing pretty good, Justin. How about you? Um, <clears throat> the, um, the regular day for the, uh, audiobooks podcast is supposed to be Sundays, but as a... Planning to release a Spanish album. No, I did not know that. I think it's cool. 
Um, anyway, the uh, audiobooks podcast is um, supposed to be released every Sunday. That was the original plan, but uh, as a way of thanking you guys for being there for me and helping me through that really bad spot the other day, I wanted to put up a bonus episode as a way of thanking you. So I uh, put up the um, the next chapter of the book. That will be chapter two. So now you've got chapters one and chapters two, uh, if you want to listen to them. Um, but uh, it was just my way of thanking you guys for uh, being there for me and helping me through kind of a really, really bad spot. Elsa! So now you have two episodes that you can listen to if you so choose. Who she was named after. Guys, <clears throat> let me share something with you from my childhood. When I was growing up, are you naked in the audio? Well, you'll just have to listen to find out. See if you can figure it out. Um, anyway, when I was a little kid growing up, um, my mom used to hate it when I would try to sing. So to as a way of her trying to get me to stop singing, I overheard her while I was standing on the front porch one night or one day. Uh, I overheard her talking to the other kids because I have a brother and two sisters. Okay. Um, and I overheard her talking to them and telling them that every time I started to sing, for them to howl like dogs. Okay. Oh, glad you hear it, Justin. It was at that point that I stopped singing. I'm like a dog and screech like a cat. It took me years to get over that, or at least to get past it enough that I could even attempt to sing.
and I still have issues with it, depending on who I'm around. Now, obviously, you guys have heard me burst into song all of a sudden because I'm comfortable around you guys. But there are certain moments, certain phrases, certain things that will cause me to just clam up immediately. Love dogs too. I knew that. My very first. Your very first what? See, here's the thing. And what I'm about to say might cause this stream to go down, just so y'all know. Oh, okay, Raymond. Um, I don't know. I have to think about it, Justin. Here's the thing. <clears throat> Nobody really knows, especially when it's like people online. You don't know what a person has been through personally. You don't know what they go through and what they face on a daily basis. And you don't know what they're feeling at the moment you're talking to them, unless they just openly tell you. But when you say something mean or hateful, seems to put you right back there. Uh, no, it was because of a comment, Elsa. But I honestly feel like the comment was made in jest, not seriously. But the comment took me back there. <clears throat> uh, but moving past that, um, we don't really know people online. Okay. We don't know what they go through. We don't know where they're at emotionally. Um, and when you say the one wrong thing to that person, that could be the one final thing that pushes them over the edge. It could be the thing that they just can't handle anymore. They've taken too much. They've faced too much. They've gone through too much. And the one mean or disrespectful comment that you make to that person could be the proverbial straw. It could push them over the edge. And that makes them reach the point. Whatever you said could finally be it. And they just can't take anymore. And they kill themselves. 
Is it really worth it? Can you live with yourself knowing that what you said, for whatever reason you said it, is what caused a person to take their own life? Is it really worth it? Are you going to brag about that? Are you going to run to all your friends? Are you going to post it all over the internet? Huh. I said the one thing. I did it. I'm the one that caused that person to kill themselves. Can you live with that for the rest of your life? Knowing that the one thing you said, the one moment you chose to be mean and to be disrespectful and to be hateful, that's the one moment that broke that person irreparably and you just caused somebody to kill themselves. Can you live with that for the rest of your life? Are you really that kind of a person? Would it really be worth it? Are you that guiltless? Are you that heartless? Are you that lonely and pathetic? That that's what you need to feel better about yourself? Do you really want to be the reason <coughs> that someone chose to take their own life? Because you decided to be mean or be a bully Yes, Alvin, if you can find a way to do it, you have my permission. Um, oh, let me say, uh, Saxon, Patrick, uh, rabbits in his room and nobody killed themselves. And ship to my cousin. I'm sorry, guys. I flipped my glasses up on my head for two reasons. One, I'm being really, really serious in the moment. <gasps> no. Thank you, Richard. I want to say it because I'm sensitive to. Oh, it's okay, uh, Alvin. Um, I wanted to say that the other day uh, because of what that guy said to me. I, I mean, about the suicide thing. Um, that was actually two different subjects. Uh, one was the howling thing, and the other one was the uh, 
bullying people online thing. Uh, but it kind of went from the howling thing over into <laughs> the bullying thing because I saw him come in and I thought, you know what? Prime opportunity. I'm going to say it because I wanted to say it the other day. Because that's honestly how I feel. Because we don't know what people go through in their daily lives. Oh, you're welcome, Alvin. Yes, I saw that, Richard, and thank you. Did he do it again in this stream? Uh, he said something, uh, but I was really, I was talking and wasn't really paying attention. It had something to do with my teeth, but honestly, I wasn't, um, I wasn't affected by it like I was the other day because of you guys, actually. Sensitive as heck. You have no idea. Yeah, see, exactly. And nobody knows just how sensitive somebody is. Well, I mean, usually. Uh, but it just, I can be sensitive, but it depends. Yeah. Rodney Atkins. Atkins, sorry. Uh, one of my favorite country music singers. Oh, okay. But you don't know what people go through. You don't know where they're at emotionally and mentally. <gasps> Robert! Lock his fucking bitch ass now. I'm going to go back to my show. See you after. Oh, okay, Robert. Basically, bag teeth or something. Yeah. Only saw his comment for a second and got royally pissed. <laughs> um, it's okay, guys. I'm, I'm all right. I just wanted that person to hear what I had to say. I didn't say it because he made that comment. I said it because I think he really needs to hear it. You can be glad I didn't see his comment. I would have ripped him, ripped into him. Yeah, uh, I just... Uh, the comment actually didn't affect me, and that is thanks to you guys. He put two comments. Yes, I saw them both. Um, because the first one was, uh, no, wait, there was three, because the first one was, hello there, and the second one was, I have all y'all in here blocked, and the third one was something about my teeth. Um, yeah, it's just, he needs to understand that just because he's on the other end of a computer screen doesn't mean what he says doesn't affect people. And if he says the wrong thing to the wrong person and that person is unstable enough and they've been through one too many things, he's going to cause somebody to kill themselves. He's going to cause somebody to break. Let me take a shower. Ooh, naked and wet. I can pick on you. <laughs> it depends on my mood, Raymond. Um, you just, you have to watch what you say to people because some people can't handle it. He had us blocked. <laughs> That's what he said. He said he had all us blocked. <laughs> also, apparently he's not figured out that we had him blocked a long time ago. <laughs> Blocked his ass long ago. Yes, exactly. Hmm, interesting. Yeah. He's a blockhead. He's a dumbass. Maybe I need to double check. Yeah, true, Remy. Yeah. How long have you been streaming as of this year? Streaming? Um... What has it been, three years now, guys? Does April make three years, I think? I think. Knock his block off, yeah.
but no, uh, the uh, the teeth comment didn't bother me this time, and that is because of you guys. I do know a certain stalker has all of Trisha's posse blocked, or so I've been told. Yeah. Three years this April. I think so, yeah. Yep, three years in April. Oh, okay. Again, <laughs> three years in April. Okay, yeah, I nailed it. <laughs> Not even sure, but it's been fun. It has been fun. I've had a few mental meltdowns, but other than that, it's been fun. Whoever it is should go to jail over it. Good to know. Mm -hmm. I reported him. Yeah, Raymond reported him and uh, Robert blocked him. Give him five minutes, he'll make a new account and come back. How did he do that? Just clicking on our names and just blocking us like that, I guess. Apparently the posse is too much for him to handle. <laughs> yes, me. We did jumped. Elsa and Raymond answered you at the same time. Yes, I noticed that. I recorded him too the other day. Oh, okay. What I was thinking too. Let him. I need to let off some steam. That's right. Get him. <laughs> Look, I know the dude has issues, but damn. You know, find a hobby other than stalking and tormenting. Those are not hobbies. We all need to let off some steam. <laughs> hmm. Just itching for a spanking. Nice. Go, you know, read a book, listen to an audio book, watch TV, go stick your head up Garth's ass, something. Clicking on your name, you can be blocked, but then how are we still in the stream if we're blocked? No, 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 not blocked from the stream, blocked where we can't get to him. Human family, and I do not, I repeat, do not play that shit at all. You guys are awesome. <laughs> it's like I always say, you mess with one of us, you mess with all of us. Yes. Kidding. Oh, it's okay, Alvin. I, I got what you said. Keyboard ninja sometimes. <laughs> Top too fast. Ah. Don't laugh, you loser. Well, he needs a laugh or a hobby or something. I mean, obviously he doesn't have one or he wouldn't just be bothering people for no reason. I mean, it's not like we're doing anything to him. We're just sitting here streaming, chatting with each other. 
All right. Wait, I don't know. Damn it. I don't know who came in late. Um, <clears throat> okay, guys, the reason uh, the thumbnail and title are what they are, in case you missed me announcing it. Get himself a hobby. Yeah. He needs to bugger the hell off. Yeah, that works too. Um, to thank you guys for being there for me the other night when I fell apart. Um, there's not a whole lot I can do, but if he doesn't come after me, I'm such a weakling. He might beat me up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That'd be terrible. Mm -hmm. Uh, yes, at this point, yes. I don't have that many hobbies, but I do know I'm too busy and occupied with my life to just harass others online. Yeah, move on already. <laughs> okay, um, before I finish what I was saying, let me uh, interrupt myself and step in here and say, listen, honey. Um you need to kind of do a complete 180 and just kind of observe and take in the vast amount of off in which you can fuck. Anyway, like I was saying, um, shitting my pants. <laughs> I know what you meant, Alvin. Um, moving on. <laughs> <laughs> um, as a kind of a thank you for you guys for being there the other night. Alvin, are you streaming Sunday? <laughs> thank you, Alvin. Um, I put up a bonus episode that chapter two was not supposed to be put up until Sunday because Sunday is the day that I uh, upload new episodes of the audiobook podcast. But I put up a bonus episode. So now chapter one and two are up. Chapter three will go up Sunday. So you have a bonus episode that you weren't originally <laughs> scheduled to have. So that's just kind of my way of, you know, giving you something special, something extra as a way of thanking you for being there for me the other night when I fell apart. You know, I want to edit that part <laughs> and tweet you saying <laughs> fuck all speech too. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Nighty night. So you should dedicate the stream to Betty White for her birthday on Sunday. Oh! Betty White's birthday is on Sunday? I streamed this last Sunday, but you and Wild Bill weren't there. 99th. Damn, really? I wasn't home or I would have been there, bro. Bumble! Just finished taking a sexy shower. Nice! Gotta love the sexy. London! Sorry, I was late. What I missed, um, you missed my fuck off speech and uh, me announcing that there's a bonus episode up on the uh, audiobooks podcast. Uh, and you missed an asshole that was in here with us. Uh, but other than that, not much. <laughs> Just one more year. She will make it a whole century. If anybody doesn't know, Betty White made an appearance on King of the Hill on the episode called Escape from Party Island. Oh, sorry, Landon.
Um, guys, I do the audiobook thing because one, I love audiobooks. Two, I love podcasts. And uh, three, it gives me a way for you guys to be able to experience my books without ever having to buy them. Here's the thing. If you've ever wanted to help me financially, but you can't buy, you know, buying any of my stuff, this is a way for you to help me financially. <laughs> wow, thank you, Alan. Favorite food is, uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, I'm not going there. About to get hot in here, and we. <laughs> see his comments. <laughs> A podcast on Shana. No. Dude, I already have like seven podcasts. Do you really think I need another one? Wait a minute. You don't even listen to the ones I've got. <clears throat> anyway, my point. Damn it. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I know that little trick, Landon. Um, yes, you do. Uh -huh. You don't even listen to the ones I've already got. Anyway, if you've ever wanted to help me financially, this is a way for you to do it. You don't even have to listen to the episode, okay? Just click. You need 10. That's just three more. <laughs> I'm going to kick your ass. If you just go to the link and just click play, you can mute it. You don't even have to listen to it. Just let it play. It helps me make a few cents. Ten. Well, wait, I have seven podcasts and two YouTube channels, four websites. Does that count? And two Facebook pages. That doesn't count my regular Facebook. Shania podcast. But still manifest. Shana releasing new music this year, 2021, baby. I can always block him so we can have fun with him. Uh, oh, you can always unblock him so we can have fun with him. All right. I can steal while I sleep, but promise me it won't give me nightmares. No, but if an episode is going to give you nightmares... Uh, I am nice enough to give forewarnings before the episode. And I will do it before the episode ever goes up live. I will give a trigger warning. And believe me, near the end of this book, you're going to need a trigger warning. In the beginning of it, for the first several chapters, you're good to go. No nightmares. But when it gets near the end, oh yeah, there's a huge trigger warning. I have a confession. I haven't listened to the revenge episode yet. Okay. And now I don't even have the link to it anymore because I deleted my Facebook today. Oh shit. You deleted your Facebook and I just spit on myself. Elsa, honey, are you okay? I really want to have fun with the troll though, Robert. <laughs> well, of course we do. Wait, hang on, hang on. Elsa, you can still get the link. Trigger warnings don't work. <laughs> I have Facebook video chat, naked land action. I have a sensitive snowflake, no dirty words. Oh God. <laughs> oh, speaking of dirty words. Um, For anyone who may have missed it, yesterday, I think it was, I got two, one in the morning and one at night, notifications from YouTube. Telling me, the first one told me a video of mine had been taken down due to the content um, breaking YouTube's rules and guidelines. And then the one I got late last night said a video of mine had been age restricted. 
due to content. Now, the first one, <clears throat> and I love this, it was due to sex and nudity. Apparently in the thumbnail, which is ironic because the video had no thumbnail. So, yes, I challenged it. Move to me, we yells up. Damn, there's no point of me coming back to Facebook now. Frozen girl ain't there anymore. Aww. Um, actually, the first one was a live stream I did way back. Wasn't a nightmare. Crazy ones where your head hurts when the alarm wakes you up. Ever have that? Oh yeah. Never get nude in your videos. I know, right? Because I'm sick of Facebook censoring shit. Yeah. Putting a warning on my page for stupid comment I made. And that comment wasn't even offensive. I made way more offensive comments than that. Well, you were just repeating what the person said. I mean, my God. Um, let's see. The second video was actually a video, and they said it was uh, age-restricted now due to the content and, you know, community guidelines and all that crap. Well, so much for naked land. <laughs> <clears throat> I did appeal both and won both. And the one video, and I know y'all are going to find this amazing, but that one video that got age restricted, brace yourself because you ain't going to believe this shit, but it's real. There is obviously no sex and no nudity. There's no kids in the video. There's no questionable material in the video. There is not even a cuss word. Yes, I did a whole video without cussing. There was literally nothing in that video except me standing there talking to the camera. And I was fully clothed the entire time. Good old fashioned values, yeah. Well, Billy did not. Um, I don't know unless he fell asleep. Feel so much better now that I don't have it anymore. I kind of feel free now. Well, there you go. You say fully clothed? I know, right? Okay, wait, it jumped. Okay, I really love this podcast based off my favorite book series called Hank, The Cow Dog, stars Matthew McConaughey. Nice! Oh, I love it. I can't believe YouTube would block sex and nudity because it seems today that all you see is violence in movies and sex on TV, right? Oh, damn it. <laughs> the only downside is I can't talk to you guys on Messenger anymore. No, I was going to say go over to MeWe, but you tried that once before and had issues with it, didn't you?
I didn't miss them, Alvin, but they were for Elsa, not for me, so I didn't read them out loud. Yeah, wouldn't even allow toilets on TV. Yeah. They won't block you. You're on the right side of their politics. Oh, their political narrative and agenda. So you're safe. Ah. Wait a minute. Hang on. Elsa, I have two ways. <clears throat> Technically, I have three ways. Uh, you said you couldn't get the link because you deleted your Facebook. Yes, you can. Uh, the link to that podcast is the first link below. make it past the censors in TV shows back in the 80s and 90s, but now everything is offensive, right? <clears throat> if it's offensive, all you have to do is click off the video. It's really that simple, right, Bumble? I mean, they make remote controls for a reason, people. If you're watching something on TV and you find it offensive, change the fucking channel. If you can't find the remote, get off your big dead sorry ass and walk over and push the button on the TV. And if you're on the computer and you're watching a video on YouTube and you find it offensive, click off the video and go to another one. Or, or, oh my God, watch this. If you're watching something and it offends you, okay, you're on your phone, okay? If you're on your phone and you find something offensive, watch this, watch this. Oh, my God, I put it down. Now, watch this. If it's on your computer and it offends you, watch this. You see how simple that was, you stupid dumbasses? Walk away from it. Close your laptop and walk away. Walk outside and go get a life. Stop being offended by every damn little thing you see. Okay? Either walk away from it, close your laptop, put down your phone, turn off your TV, walk away from what offends you, you fucking dumbasses. God. Stress buster, heat beating too fast. Oh, oh, you mean heart beating too fast. Raymond, and I'm not being funny. Have you ever tried meditating? You are very funny. Thank you. Time to get your pump back out, Raymond. Oh, that'll make his heart beat faster. And demonetized. <laughs> oh, yeah. Heart. Yeah, I know what you meant, Raymond. If it's an opinion, doesn't make you doesn't make me right or you right. It's just how we both feel on what's going on in the world. Yes. Everybody has the right to their own opinions. Yes. Did you watch that boogie video? Oh God, no, I didn't see it all the way through yet. I watched part of it and then got distracted by something and never got to go back to it. Three ways. Yeah. <laughs> well, I walked right into that one, didn't I? Yes, Landon, that is exactly what I said. Take that however you will. Um, actually, I was talking to Elsa when I said that, and I meant um, 
The link to that new podcast, the audiobooks podcast, is in the description below. It's the top link. Uh, or you can go to the Us Pets Queens audiobooks podcast YouTube channel. And the links to the actual podcast are in the description of those videos. Or I can just post the link here or somebody else can grab it and post it here. Hey, you did what in your bed? <laughs> you wish, Alvin. Apparently everyone on the right has no right to an opinion. Really? A bunch of Nazi commies. Okay. And demonetized. <laughs> They're a bunch of Hitlers. And re-demonetized. <laughs> Got too distracted. Uh, yes, I'm very easily distracted, Saxon. Did you hear what they, what he was saying? It wasn't a good, healthy idea to ban someone from social media. No. Sorry. Whoa, Bill! I fell asleep. Nailed it right here. I called it. Oh, that's right. There's a reason I ask. Uh, no, apparently I didn't get to that. I knew he talked about things not being healthy, but at that point he was talking about weight. And that's okay, Wild well, Bill. We understand that you fell asleep. I mean, you do work for a living, okay? So it's understandable. So am I. I knew it. I mean the boogie video about the anorexic girl? Yes, forgot her name. Regina Cooney. Oh wait, is that right? Is that her name? You missed all the action. So what's going on? Well, dumbass came in. Um, I announced the bonus episode of my podcast as a thank you to you guys. And I told somebody just how far they could fuck off. That pretty much covers it. Oh, and Robert blocked somebody. <laughs> the other night when the Republicans were getting banned, he was all for it and praised Facebook and Twitter, okay, for doing it. That's why I told you he was being he was being hypocritical critical. I can see where you're coming from on that. I mean, if it's good for the goose, it's good for the gander. Hello? Eugenia! That's it! Eugenia! Eugenia Cooney! Thank you, Bumble. <laughs> And demonetized. Yes. Yeah. Oh, and by the way, you get demonetized now every time you say her name. Eugenia, I think. Oh, yep. You nailed it, Elsa. So happy to hear the F bomb. <laughs> <clears throat> is that the actress who voices Meg? No, no. No, this is an anorexic girl on uh, YouTube. Eugenia Cooney. Oh, okay. Thank you, Justin. You know, why the hell I called her Regina? Her name is Eugenia. <laughs> and Elsa is the <laughs> I'm thinking so. <clears throat> what did she do this time? Nothing. Just the same old, same old. Still scrawny ass. 
still refuses to get help, still influencing little girls, you know, that kind of thing. Oh, okay, Mila Kunis is who Landon is thinking of. Oh, okay. Well, there you go, Landon. Apparently, some people, once again, have started a petition to get her banned from YouTube. <clears throat> Last name sounds similar. Yes, yes, I do. That podcast is what I was talking about, Trish. Oh, cool. Okay. Thank you, Justin. Where can I sign that petition? Uh, actually, I don't know, but if you just Google it, you should be able to find it fairly easily. Because it's pretty popular right now. Turn you on camera if you're going to be streaming for a bit longer. Um, yeah, well, I didn't have any plans. I mean, oh, that sounded weird when I said it, but in my head it sounded okay. I mean, I'm not planning on going anywhere. I used to watch her videos. But it is always the same old boring drama, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, just Google it. You can sign it. <laughs> They were two different people all along. I made a joke to make a point that their names sound similar. Sure, Landon, sure. Um, Raymond, are you still here? I'm going to go. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, Bill, well, try to get some sleep. I know you must be exhausted. I'll be able to watch her if all I see is someone that's so close to death. It will be highly disturbing. Yes, it is. That's why I flinch every time I even see just a picture of her. I hate it when people use her in their thumbnails because every time I go to YouTube, I'm like, let's see, what can I want? Oh, geez. Gah! Am I still here? <laughs> uh, Raymond, did you understand what I was talking about today when you asked me why I cut those boards? Worse than Momo. <laughs> Is there a picture of her in Boogie's videos? In Boogie's video. I just, I can't, mm, I can't look at her. It makes me cringe. It's like, have you ever heard somebody say, I know you're here. I just spoke to you. <clears throat> Um, have you ever heard somebody say, damn, you look like death warmed over. 
<laughs> yes, you are, Raymond. <laughs> Oh, we knew that, Elsa. No, you didn't speak to me. I did so. I even asked you a question. I'm going to pull it up on my computer and then minimize it just to listen to the audio. Gotcha. What was the question? See, you were ignoring me. See how you are ignoring me? I said, did you understand what I meant when I told you why I cut that board in two? No. I was kind of afraid of that. Yes, I understand. Okay, now you're just confusing me. Now you're just doing it on purpose. using a two by four though that's oh you're killing me that is the exact board i showed you and you said i could use it two by four. yes i am see the heater isn't in front of the coffee pot otherwise we might have seen another rant. <laughs> uh, it's a different heater. Messing around with you. I think he is. Welcome to Construction 101. Raymond, that is the board you told me to use. It's treated lumber. Of course it's treated lumber. She's going to beat you with a two by four if you keep it up.
cracking me up. Where did Alvin go? I don't know. He ran away. Okay. Eight fifty six. Oh, good. Field trip with Patrick tomorrow. Where are you going? Did your door, door just open? No, the floor above me just made some noise. Two or three different times. No one lives up there, you guys. He won't tell me. Oh, cool. That is creepy. No. Oh. That's exciting. I live there now. Well, you could have told me, man. Damn, I could have come seen you. See how you are hiding out from me? See? See how you are? I thought little big boy moved. He did. <laughs> okay, so there's not supposed to be anybody living up there. But I just heard something up there. What, do you need a cup of sugar? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, what if I did? You'd feel bad, wouldn't you? Take what you need. Oh, <laughs> or a two by four. <laughs> oh, okay. Good night, Saxon. Have fun. Enjoy your trip. And have lots of sex. And demonetized. <laughs> I hear shit coming from upstairs in my house all the time. When nobody is up there. I seriously think my grandma's ghost is in this house. Not even lying. It's possible. Let's we'll see. Robert, she could be watching over you. Will do. All right. Exactly. See ya. <laughs> Hang on. Um, Elsa, if you need the links to any of my podcasts or any of my channels or, or whatever, uh, I, I think the last time I updated my links for my live streams, <clears throat> I think I actually made one section of just my podcasts. So the links to all my podcasts should be together down in the description. So any of them that you may be interested in, the link should be down there. And if not, let me know.
Seriously, sometimes I do not see white shadows at the corner of my eye. That's why I'm thinking she is still here, if you will. Uh, well, Robert, that is very possible. And the fact that it is white shadows is a very good sign. Just a heads up, I might make a video later and post the link. Wait, it jumped. In the chat group on Messenger. Oh, okay, Landon. <clears throat> yeah, good question, Robert. What are you making a video about? I mean, if you don't mind us asking. And do we need a trigger warning? You know which one I like to listen to. Okay, I'm pretty sure the link to that one is already there. Yes. <laughs> oh, and Elsa, I haven't updated you in a few days, but it went from four to six. So whatever you're doing is freaking awesome. <laughs> okay. Ghost rock. It was me. I would run like hell, Robert. <laughs> All righty. Glad to hear. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it more than you know. No, oh, that just, that tickled me to death. I mean, seriously, I know you guys have always wished that you could help me. And this is actually a way that you can. Because, like I said, that just that few cents adds up. Uh, Elsa has that one account up to six bucks. Six bucks. Just some things I found at Goodwill recently. Awesome. So, like I was saying earlier, guys, I wasn't kidding. If you just go to Anchor to that podcast and just hit play, you don't even have to listen. You can just hit play and mute it. So then it's playing, so I'm making a few cents, and I'm making it because you're willing to hit play. How many smoothies can you buy with that? Five. <laughs> oh, yeah. See how quick I did that math in my head? <laughs> Love me a good smoothie. <laughs> it did scare me at first, but then I thought about it. It's just my grandma. She would hurt me, even in ghost form. True. Ew. Ew. Remember, you could have went all day and not asked that question. Ew. What is so gross? And if you play it from the most repent, re, repent, uh huh, repent episode, it will move automatically to the next episode. It doesn't work that way if you start from episode one. Ah, okay. <laughs> Not yet. Oh, I like how you put yet as if there's still hope. doing I 
when Raymond is here, he always cracks me up and has me laughing. Because I'm, I'm the funny guy. <laughs> Plays the episodes backwards. Which is fine if you're not listening to an audio <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Hey guys, check this out. <clears throat> I already have, oh dang, I lost count, either four or five Christmas presents for my son for this upcoming Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if it plays them in reverse, then you're kind of lost, or it feels kind of like uh, Robert. Uh, like you're listening to a prequel. <laughs> here's the end. Now here's everything that led up to it. <laughs> so you're going in reverse order like you're going as a prequel. Hello. Hello. Ah, okay. There we go. <laughs> Where's mine? One. Where's your what? Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want an invite, Elsa? <laughs> <laughs> well, Bill would shoot a brick, wouldn't he? Hello, Raymond. That's what I do when I'm reading a book. I would read the beginning. And then I would cheat and read the end. Because my curiosity gets the best of me. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, well, see, you can't do that with mine. Because I only record one episode at a time. So you've got chapter Damn one, and you've got chapter two, and then you have to wait for me to record the rest of it. <laughs> so if anything happens to me before I finish recording it, you will never know what actually happened. <laughs> That's just mean. <clears throat> oh, where's your Christmas presents? I haven't ordered yours yet. <laughs> Country fan. Welcome. That's right. He said hello, Robert. Me. <laughs> you can always ask Bill. Oh, yeah. What's up? Not much. What's up with you? The sky? No, nothing. Gas prices? Yep. Rich people's bank accounts? When are you cutting more boards? Uh, I'm supposed to go back up there tomorrow. 
uh, you may be getting pictures from me. Now, remember, I can't video chat while I'm up there because it eats up my data, but I can send you pictures. I have an idea, but before I do it, I want to run it by you first. So I, in order to explain it, I kind of have to lay it out and take pictures and send them. But I think I can get across my point uh, before I do any more cutting. Have to watch the beginning of the stream, Chris. Uh, yeah, because you done missed it. There was me announcing, but let's see, you were in the group chat last night, so you already know the bonus episode. Uh, and then a dumbass showed up, and then I told someone just you know <clears throat> how just how far they could fuck off, <laughs> basically. <laughs> And then Robert blocked their ass. Because <laughs> he the man. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome. How long before you're on the roof? Well, I'm hoping... Oh, wait. This is Wednesday, isn't it? Um... It should be this week or next week if everything goes well, <laughs> depending on weather. And could you please not send any more bad weather down here? I'm never going to get the panels on the roof if you keep sending me bad weather. You just do it for meanness and then you sit up there and laugh. Don't think I don't know. Won't be long before she... Wait. Oh, it jumped. Falls off that roof. Oh, God. Saw his comments. I would have blocked his ass, too. Uh-huh. I'm surprised they haven't been back tonight. Yeah, I, I was kind of surprised by that, too. Man, if you're going to take that much time and that much effort to come up with and create a whole new Gmail, a whole new YouTube channel, just to come at somebody. Damn, son, you could have a hobby that you could do faster than that. Mm -hmm. As to work then, <laughs> or I'm going to send you into a deep breeze. Damn! <laughs> it won't be long, damn it. <laughs> Stupid autocorrect. No, 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 no. Elsa, that's what the safety rope is for. Because I sure as hell ain't getting up there without one, because y'all know me. I can't walk on the ground without running face first into something or bumping into something or tripping over something. Imagine that on the roof with no safety cord. Mm -mm, not going to happen. Okay, I'm going to ask a question, but if you know the answer, don't say the answer. <clears throat> Just say yes or no. Do you know the answer or not? Yes or no? Do you know what osculating is? Oh, thank God. I'm so glad I'm not the only mm -hmm. one. Get you from injuring yourself? Yes, exactly, Elsa. Yes. I'm not surprised. Rabbit will catch you. Yeah, right. No, no. Okay, I've got three no's and one yes. <clears throat> oh, I'm so glad it's not just me. Okay, I bought a heater today. Okay, because I took mm -hmm. the other heaters up to Rabbit's. I thought, you know what, if I can warm up a couple of rooms, 
I can work. So I put both heaters in one room because it was like ice cold in there. And that's the room I needed to work in. I run the extension cord. Uh, the dude next door helped me start the uh, generator. I got everything plugged in. Room is warming up. And I thought, you know what? After I worked for a couple hours, I thought, yeah, this is good. I think I need one more heater, and that should make it perfect. So I went and I bought a new heater. Okay. The box says, osculating ceramic heater. I bring it home. I take it out of the box. I always test it before I take it up there, right? That way, if it don't work, I can just take it back and get another one. I plug it up, I turn it on, it works. It's on right now behind me. And I'm like, okay, it's on, it's running. Yeah, good heat. Just work fast. That will heat you up nicely. <laughs> oh, yeah, it will. I don't know if you will be able to see this. There is a button. It says OSC, short for osculating. Uh -huh. I don't know if y'all can see it move. No, no, you can't because it's black. It is literally moving back and forth. Back and forth. Come on. That is what osculating means. It means it moves back and forth. You ever have a fan that does that? Mm -hmm. I've had several fans that move. If you pull that piece on the back of them, but if you, I don't know if you pull it up or push it down, one, it, it makes it rotate basically back and forth. So it's cooling the entire room. That's osculating. I don't know why they just don't say it rotates. You have to be all fancy and confusing and go and osculating. No, damn it, it moves. That's all you got to say. It moves, okay? <laughs> Pull it up. Okay, see, see, you know what I'm talking about. Oddly, I've had several of those fans that did that throughout my lifetime. And I do not remember seeing the word osculating on any of those. Never seen one of those heaters before. Yeah, you and me too. I didn't even know they made heaters that rotated. Huh. Watch the news today. I brought up that YouTube. You now ban Donald Trump post video on YouTube. Yeah, I saw that. Uh, what did I see that? Oh, Don uh, Donald, shit. Um, Philip DeFranco was talking about it today. Because he also said something about, and I was so confused because I don't follow politics, but he said something about Donald Trump being um, impeached again. Uh -huh. He said again. And I went, wait, what? When was he impeached before? Yep. This is the second time? What? I didn't think they impeached him the other time. They did, but the Senate overturned it. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, now it makes sense. Okay, thank you. Which one? <laughs> you, want, you want to know what's stupid about them doing it this time? Uh, yeah. The trial's not going to take place till after Biden takes office. So what's, what's the point? point? I don't make a, a lot of sense. Pull it up to make it stand still and push it down to make it rotate. Okay, yes, thank you. Yes, that's it exactly. Huh, which actually makes sense because if you push that in, it rotates. If you push
push it back out, it doesn't rotate. Oh, yeah, work same. Yep. Impeach. That's a joke. For what? For him exposing their crimes? Well, yeah. I mean, geez, Elsa. <laughs> you know, I can't let him get away with that. Oh, my God. <laughs> It just don't make a whole lot of sense to me. And if it's for the crap that went on where all those people went into that building, the Capitol, if that's why, well, that's real close to next door to stupid. He didn't make them go there. He didn't hold a gun on them and say, go where I'm going to kill you. He didn't make them do it. He didn't force them into it. Not his fault if they're stupid. <laughs> oh, my God. That's not political. That's not me making a political statement. That's just common sense, people. Think for yourself. Raymond, she's going to get you. Keep, keep it up. What? Oh, oh. Because that's a big word for down or up. In them there, he'll. Oh, I'm so gonna kick your ass, <laughs> God Almighty! No evidence. I just wasted millions. Oh, great. Yeah, because that's what they need to do right now. Waste millions of dollars. Yeah. Uh, they're at the time when the riot started. Oh, okay. You're welcome. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm going to sneeze. I swear to God. I know I am. And just like that, it went away. Okay. All right. I don't want to sneeze anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the heater moves back and forth. See? Simple. There you go! See? How simple! <laughs> Osculates. <laughs> to me, that's just a, you know, $40 word when a 10 cent word will do. <laughs> it osculates. It moves. That's it. It moves. Seven days left. For all the simple mind. <laughs> well, no sense in using big words when little words will do. Uh-huh. It's like being polite when you don't have to. I mean, you can go the long way around about it and try to be nice, or you can just tell somebody to go fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, seriously. <laughs> Got a lot of dirt on them. Yeah, you'd think that would uh, kind of back the hell off him. To jail their sorry asses. Hmm. Watch Rodney Atkins' video yet. Wait, hang on. Hang on. Crap. 
I watched one today, Country, and I'm almost sure it was the one you sent me. Hang on. Yeah, I have message after message. Okay, hang on. Nope. Yes, I did watch it. <clears throat> what? Landon done got kicked from the live stream, stupid YouTube. What? That's what his comment says. Kicked off the live stream. I had to find my way back. Oh, dear God. That's right, yo. Uh, yes, and I thought he did a fantastic job, but at the same time, I went and found the original, and I have played that and listened to it all day long. No pun intended. Um, I'm sorry, let me rephrase that. No Garth pun intended. Um, <laughs> but, uh, but I started changing the lyrics to it in my head, and that may or may not have been a good thing. Uh, <coughs> <clears throat> Sorry, choked on nothing apparently. Um, right, country band. Uh, Elsa, he's a country music singer. Two hundred and twelve million were out of power. Damn. <sighs> Um, hmm, wait a minute. Is Landon part of the Tripsters group? Yep. Okay, uh, country fan, post that in the group if you don't care so that Landon can see it. That whole country was out. Wait, what country? Which country are we talking about? Obviously uh, the one didn't have power. Obviously so. I should have figured that out, shouldn't I? <laughs> Just look out across the world, that one dark spot. That's it. <laughs> um, <clears throat> Robert, are you wearing a bracelet? Mm-hmm. What's on it? One says, holding our own. It's the Eric Church group on Facebook. Okay. And then I got another one above it that's for Jeff Gordon. Nice. Okay. And then I got one of these. Ah. Oh, that's cool. I always wanted one of those. That's uh, one of the survival bracelets. Oh, okay. Uh, the reason I asked is because my son wears those too. And his usually have something on them. I'm trying to think what he's got on right now. I can't remember. I think it has to do with oh, what? Um, something to do with music, I think. <coughs> Pakistan. Ah, okay. Okay, now I'm all called up. Yeah. Oh, you already did post the video in the group chat? Oh, okay. Well, thank you, country fan.
Um, no, not all the way through yet. Uh, Robert sent me that too, and I was watching it and got distracted, and I uh, haven't got to go back and finish watching it yet. Tried to arrest the Pope. I heard they did arrest him. Damn. For, the actual for Pope? Child, yeah, for child sex trafficking. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Yep. Please tell me they're wrong. Oh, well, from what he's been saying, I don't think they are. Uh, he yes, also said it. He also so, said you don't have to know know God to get into heaven. You don't have to believe. Okay, uh, don't stand real close to him because when lightning strikes, I mean, you know. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Along with other things. Okay. Uh, yes, Landon, I did see your comment. Uh, normally, I would have burst into song for that, but not now. It was clever, though. Yes, yes, it was. Also involved in election interference. Oh, dang. Wait. Yep. Election in Italy or like our election or what? In America. Oh damn. That's where they that's where the Dominion computers were were put at. Oh, okay. Well that makes sense. Why not? You're already demonetized. <laughs> Um, I'd rather not open that wound again, but thank you. Damn Italians. <laughs> yeah, but they damn good cooks. <laughs> mm -hmm. out soon. That's also the reason why they want to impeach him. Oh, wow, that just connected. The dots just connected in my head. That could be a scary thing. We were using the satellite in Italy to do it. Damn. I'll be right back. Okay, country. So he can't run. Wait, so he can run in 2024? Wait, I'm confused. If he's impeached, can he still run? Nope. Oh, so he meant so he can't run in 2024. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. He corrected it. Okay, never mind. Dude, look who just caught up. <laughs> I didn't see the comment quick enough. <laughs> Is Obama was the orchestrator. Sorry, ass. Yeah. <laughs> He's just preaching to the choir now. Yeah. He's going to jail. Do not pass go. Do not collect 200. Go to jail. Go directly to jail. <laughs> and there is no get out of jail free card. Well, he is a Democrat, so, you know. Well. Not to get political. Hmm. Well, it was kind of my fault. I kind of started it. I was just confused. So I was like, wait, when did he get impeached before? How the hell did I miss that? Son of a bitch. <laughs> you would have thought I would have seen something. Because <laughs> when... when um. Philip was talking about it today. He said he's the first president to ever be impeached twice. And I was like, twice? When the hell was the first time and how did I miss it? I don't think so. Maybe. 
it's about some money. Oh, never mind. It's a letter. Great. Catch me live on Robert's channel and give me something to try I've never eaten before. He loves it when I try new things on his channel. Mm. Ow. I'm bitten you sound like y'all. Mm. Oh my God, that's good. Been there. <laughs> was too fast for me. <laughs> oh my God. Welcome guys. back, Country Pain. Oh, yeah. Hey, welcome back, Good Right. Skittles. Mm -hmm. Wait. I've eaten Skittles before. I hope so. They're dipped in yogurt. I've seen them. Ooh, those are I good. I didn't think I'd like them. Um, I can't eat those on camera because I don't have a lot of teeth, so it's hard for me to eat them. <laughs> Which is how I ended up biting the inside of my jaw. Mm. I didn't think I'd like them, so I never tried them. Oh, really? Well, I got Bubba so now, And I figured... I got a time. hate him so much I have to make up stuff because there's nothing real they can use against him ah isn't that usually the way it works put your eyeball back woman <laughs> oh yeah Damn, I forgot. So. No. Okay, well, if I don't do it now, I might not get to do it tonight. Okay, uh, guys, I'm going to have to wrap it up. I forgot I was supposed to do something while ago, and if I don't do it now, I won't get a chance to. Uh, but uh, thank you for letting me stream on your channel, and thank you for joining me. You're welcome. And uh, guys, thank you for hanging out and um, for all the fun that we had. And uh, Robert, thank you for blocking the dumbass. Anytime. Well, we get plenty of rest. And hopefully we get to see you tomorrow. That's what it looked like. Yes, it dawned on me after you said that. I was like, oh my God, it really does. <laughs> and peace out. Oh yeah. Uh, but guys, I will be back tomorrow. As long as I don't, you know, fall off a roof or anything. Um, <laughs> then I might be back in traction tomorrow. <laughs> Kidding. Okay, but guys, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, and remember, the links to the podcast are down below. And there is a bonus episode, so you get chapter one and two. Uh, and chapter three will drop on Sunday. But guys, that is going to do it for now. Uh, for Robert and myself, this is Ice Pets Queen, leader of the posse. Stay horny, my friends, and we are tripping out. <laughs>